Damn, son, where'd you find this? You gotta be kidding me, right? I don't know what's going on, going on with Marvel, man. Like, it's getting worse. Um, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel for another video, man. Um, so, Cosmic Wonder um, just posted on um, a video about uh, Avengers 5. I, well, I, the Avengers 5, not King Dynasty anymore. And Doctor Doom replacing Kane the Conqueror. Like, what is going on? What, like, what in the hell is going on? <sighs> We're about to go go ahead and you, you know see what what is what they talked about, what's going on. So uh, make sure you guys subscribe, like, comment, hit like, hit the button. Right for the do. Let's get it. The Loki season two finale was incredible. It was the conclusion, at least so far, of the 14 year journey that Tom Hiddleston has had with Loki. Now we've heard he is coming back and we believe that he is coming back again in Avengers Secret Wars. However, somebody else's future in the MCU right now is a big question mark. And that is mm. Kang the Conqueror slash the actor who plays him, Jonathan Majors. Mm. Jonathan Majors returned in Loki season two as not only he who remains, but also Victor Timely as well. And of course, we saw him as the King the Conqueror in Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania. Okay. He is set to be the big bad villain of the multiverse saga. However, we have heard recently that might not be the case anymore and that Jonathan Majors and the character Kang the Conqueror and any other Kang variants might be out of the MCU as the big bad. And in fact, Avengers Kang Dynasty might not even be Avengers Kang Dynasty anymore. You might have heard not too long ago that that Marvel Studios got rid of the writer for Kang Dynasty, Jeff Loveness, and today we have a new report stating that the reason this happened is because there is no longer a focus on Kang the Conqueror. Now, some of you may be asking, well, how is that even possible? They set him up to be the big bad, especially in that post credit scene from Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania. And yes, that is true, but unfortunately, things can change. And since Jonathan Majors has been going through quite a lot recently, Marvel Studios unfortunately had to decide which direction they're going to go with not only Jonathan Majors and Kang the Conqueror, but the MCU in general. And it would be kind of weird to write Kang out of the MCU, but it is also entirely possible, and this does make it possible and opens up Marvel Studios to bring in Victor Von Doom, aka Doctor Doom, as the main villain of the multiverse saga. Mm. This was actually reported recently in an article from Variety. And actually, they specifically mentioned in that article that Marvel Studios was thinking about how to move forward without Kang. Kang being the villain, and one mm. of the answers to that that Marvel Studios had thought of themselves was to replace him with Doctor Doom. Now, if you're okay. not aware of the situation, Jonathan Majors right now, the actor who plays Kang the Conqueror, Victor Timely, he who remains all of the Kang variants, is currently going through trial for cases against him for assault. He is facing up to one year in prison if he is found guilty. This has put Marvel Studios in quite a predicament. And it's quite complicated because Jonathan Majors and his legal team from the very beginning have stated that he is innocent and is in fact the victim and that he, he was assaulted innocent. and they claim like, that they have the, substantial the evidence to prove this so marvel studios was kind of playing the waiting game and kudos to them for not just firing him automatically when these claims came out against him but unfortunately it looks like they might be moving away from kang in general despite what happens in this trial today's report is coming from joanna robinson many of you might have heard her name recently as she is one of the authors of mcu the reign of marvel studios the book has caught a lot of attention and it's a great book if you haven't read it or listened to it yet, I do recommend it. And especially if you want to know the history of Marvel Studios, it's really great on that. The authors of that book, including Joanna Robinson, interviewed over a hundred different people who worked with or around Marvel Studios. They spilled a lot of tea, talked about a lot of the inside stuff that goes on. And today on the podcast that she co-hosts, The Ringerverse, she said that a source told her 
that Jeff Loveness, who was the writer for King Dynasty, who also wrote Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania, was removed from King Dynasty because the entire Kang story was being scrapped. So if this is what? true, that means no more Kang, which means Avengers Kang Dynasty is no longer going to be called Avengers Kang Dynasty, so we'll refer to it as oh Avengers 5. Lord. Although, keep in mind and note, this is not 100% confirmed. This is just something okay, that she said okay. a source has told her. And keep in mind, this is simply an option for Marvel Studios to do. They might have already begun to go down this route, but it's still an option. Because I would like to think that if Jonathan Majors is found innocent, they would keep him as Kang the Conqueror, but here's the deal. Originally, Marvel Studios did not plan on Kang the Conqueror being the main villain of the multiverse saga. What happened was when they saw wow. Jonathan Majors' portrayal of He Who Remains and then Kang in Quantumania, they decided that it was so good that they should make Kang the main villain of the multiverse saga, which right. makes sense considering his comic origin of yeah. traveling through space and time and mastering it. Mm -hmm. But it wasn't their original plan. And now we're wondering, well, was Doctor Doom the original main villain of the multiverse saga, especially if you consider the fact that Marvel Studios seemed to always know that the multiverse saga was going to lead up to Avengers Secret Wars, and in both issues in the comics, Doctor Doom is the main villain. And since Marvel Studios going mm. into the multiverse saga had the rights, and currently have the rights, to use Doctor Doom in the MCU, along with the Fantastic Four, perhaps that was their plan, especially if you consider when they revealed Phase 4 I at San like Diego Comic-Con, like the last it. thing Kevin Feige said was, we didn't even have a chance to talk about the Fantastic Four, so clearly, since then, Kevin Feige had plans for the Fantastic Four characters. And of course, one of the main Fantastic Four characters is Doctor Doom. So maybe that's their plan going forward. But how exactly will they write out Kang the Conqueror? Well, kind of fortunately, but unfortunately, the Loki season finale actually set it up for Kang to kind of go away. So getting rid of Kang and bringing Doom in or another main villain isn't actually that hard. And we'll explain how they do it. But first, big so the way the Loki finale left everything off was Loki allowing the multiverse to truly have free will, but that meant Kang variants are going to pop up. However, the TVA now has a new job, and they only have one job. Monitor every single timeline, every single universe, not for Nexus events or anything that may set the timeline in a different direction, but monitor them for Kang variants, or as they refer to Kang as he who remains. But of course, they're all Kang. Now, that's the TVA's only job now, and it could go either way. They could keep Jonathan Majors as Kang and continue on with Avengers Kang Dynasty. That would be epic. But if they decide to go a different route, all they would have to do is say the TVA takes care of Kangs. They wipe them all out. So they're not a threat. They can't cause the multiversal war because the TVA gets to them before they do anything. That really is quite simple. However, this opens it up for another villain who is a genius and Doctor Doom is one of the smartest characters in the entire MCU. It opens it up for him to make his MCU debut as the main villain who could go on to control space and time. In fact, they could even make it to where he somehow gets his hands on Kang technology. And what's mm. extremely interesting is that in the comics, Kang and Doctor Doom actually run into each other. We see oh, a shit. time displaced Kang run into Doctor Doom where they both believe that they are actually related to each other. They believe Kang is a distant ancestor of Doctor Doom and from there on out, Kang actually remodels his armor to look like Dooms, and then he goes by the Scarlet Centurion. We oh, saw a shit. version of the Scarlet Centurion in the post-credit scene for Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania. He was I a part of the Kang trio with the Mortis and Rama history. Tut. Now, doing this, like I mentioned, would also open up Avengers Secret Wars to be more comic accurate to where Doctor Doom was actually the villain. And before, we heard rumors that the ultimate Kang villain in Secret Wars was going to be a Kang variant who was also the Beyonder. He was still Kang, but was the Beyonder at the same time. Well, in the comics in Secret Wars, Doctor Doom manages to take the power of the Beyonder and becomes God Emperor Doom and rules everything. So they could still do that storyline, except kind of get rid of Kang and simply just have the Beyonder come into play. Then we would get God Emperor Doom. This really isn't that hard to do, and it seems like Marvel Studios has realized that. And if they do decide to go a different route than Kang the Conqueror, this is a pretty great option to go down. However, keep in mind, this is a report from somebody who is not a part of Marvel Studios, but who 
who has heard this from a source. So this is not 100% confirmed, but even without this report, we could assume that Marvel Studios was considering going a different direction because Variety said it in their article as well. I think ultimately it will depend on whether or not Jonathan Majors is found guilty or innocent. I think if he's innocent, they continue on with him in the MCU and Kang stays, but if he's guilty, they move on. They either recast him or they move away from Kang altogether and probably bring in Doctor Doom, but go ahead and let me know what you think about this. Would it be cool if they decided to not go the Kang route to bring in Doctor Doom? Let us know your thoughts about this in the comments down below. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe so you can stay up to date on the MCU. And if you subscribe and leave a comment below, you're automatically entered in our giveaway for a chance to win an Xbox Series X, a PS5, some Marvel Legends items, or some... Oh, man, man. Holy shit. Um, my thoughts, in my own opinion, bro, like, they should, like, move on. I think John's Majors as Kane the Conqueror, like, we, we, like, I would love to see him more. Be honest with you. We just, like, like, oh, man. I don't know how to explain it, but, because it's, it's, it's kind of, it's kind of make me mad, though. You know, um, and of course, the man is innocent. Because I'm, 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 listen, I'm team majors all the way, you know. Like, he innocent, he didn't do anything wrong. He's just these people trying to ruin, ruin people's lives like that, you know. Um, but the thing is, man, I think they should keep Kane, to be honest with you. Dr. Doom is a badass. Both Kane and Dr. Doom are, are, are badass. But what if them two, you know, you know, be in the movie together, you know, including be on the two? I mean, like, you know, for, for you know, the Avengers Second Wars. You know, what if, you know, both Kane and Doctor Doom, you know, be in the movie together? That would be epic. You know, like, think about it. Instead of, like, recast, replace, like, come on now. Like, just think about it, Marvel. Marvel, just think about it. You know, like, if y'all put put both of them in the, in the movie, then it'll be, it'll be fine. But, but at the same time, it's, 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 it's a lot. And I will say this, I think, I think they should put Beyonder as a main villain. You know, and, and of course, and of course, Kane and Dr. Doom are, are main villains as well. So I will, I would love to see all three of them in the Secret Wars. That's my, that, that's my dream. You know what I'm saying? And like, and that would be epic. I will see all all action, action like in in Secret Wars, you know. But like, if he like, cause I'm 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 a hundred percent. Jonathan Majors is is hundred percent innocent. Like now, if he found guilty, then then that means no more King the Conqueror. No more King the Conqueror. And it sucks though. Cause like seeing him in the Coin of Mania, like it, he was epic. He was badass. And like 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 cause I would love to see him more. You know, and it's it's it sucks though. It sucks. But like it 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 feels like they like rushing to put Dr. Doom. Like which we haven't like, you know, introduced him in in the MCU. But but we did see the OG Doctor Doom in the Fantastic Four movies. One and two. You know? Um but I it, it's just the fact that it it, it 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 literally makes me mad that you know it's not gonna be Avengers 5 the Kane Dynasty. We not even gonna get get to see the Kane Dynasty movie. Like because the writer, you know, I I I don't know what he got going on and stuff of like that. Like, but it, it it's crazy. But it's it's it it make me mad though, you know. Cause see, cause this is the reason why Marvel is in trouble, and then and then you got the Marvels, you know, is in big trouble at the box office, you know. So, like it's it's so much, it's so much. Like I say, Marvel, y'all got to get it together. Y'all gotta get together, you know. You know what I'm saying? Just don't fuck up 
you know, Avengers Sacred Wars. We all know. We 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 all, you know, don't want that. You know, like, cause like like ever since you know, as the Avengers Endgame, you know the the movies getting getting little little, little eh eh. You know, like, come on now, come on. Cause I've been I I've been I've been a Marvel fan like like long, so long, you know, and it's it sucks though, it sucks. Like like I'm like they even announced the uh, Kane Dynasty a while back, and now they want to like. I don't know, man. I don't know. It's it's. It's 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 too much. It's too much, man. I, it 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 makes me mad, man. It's I just want to I just want to see more of Kane, the you know you know Kane the Conqueror. Cause he's like he's like my all time not all time, but like he's like my second top two second favorite of uh, uh, of the MCU villain. So whatever y'all got going on, man, y'all need to fix it and get it together, man. Cause it's it's. It's, it, it's so much. But I am going to say this. If they... If we ain't going to get to see King the Conqueror, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. But, but, I do, I do want to see Dr. Doom, too. I do. Because he's, he's a badass, too. You know what I'm saying? I don't got no problem with Dr. Doom, either. You know, because he's the greatest villain of all time. King the Conqueror, Thanos, uh, Dr. Doom... Like, like, I also want to see Beyonder. That, like, like, he's the main one who, you know, like, all, all the, the battlegrounds and stuff like that. You know, like, like, like in the cartoons. You know, uh, I was, I would love to see him, as well. So, um, but like I say, it's, it's this Marvel is getting worse. It's getting worse. That's all I had to say. But I'm praying for my boy Jonathan Majors, man. Praying for him, hundred percent. So, um, but in the case, that's it with the video for you guys. Make sure you guys follow me on social media. I see you guys in the next video. You gotta be safe for that. And let me know in the comments what are y'all thoughts about this? You know this situation, man. Like, cause it's 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 so much. It's so much going on. So, uh, so like I say, let me know in the comments about about you know the situation. So. Uh, in the case, I, I see you guys, you know, uh, next video. You guys take care.